Hey everyone, my name is Miriam and welcome to my first YouTube video ever. I've been active on Instagram and TikTok for two years now and I'm known as Mir Lifts. The reason why I decided to start a YouTube is because I wanted to do some more detailed explanations about certain videos, certain type of content. Um, for example, the video that I'm making today is about what I pack with me to an international competition. This way I can show you all the stuff that I bring with me and explain in detail as to why I bring it with me. The goal of this video is to be very informative and I really want to help you guys with your powerlifting journey so I decided to showcase mine a bit more. One of the things that I uh, wanted you to know before I started showcasing what I pack in my suitcase is that it's really important to check with your airline um, what the luggage requirements are or to just book um, extra luggage or extra hand luggage beforehand. Because I'm flying with Ryanair, I'm not allowed to take a carry-on suitcase with me. However, I am allowed to take one uh, check baggage with me. Um, so I will show you everything that I pack inside of that. How I separate my clothes and toiletries from my powerlifting stuff. And everything that I take with me that I am allowed to take with on an international... Or that I'm allowed to use on an international competition and all the clothing that I will be taking with me. Um, I'll be going for seven days, so um, I'll make sure I have enough clothes for the duration of my stay. That is also really important to check um, when you're going to an international competition is uh, how many days are you going. Um, it's important to like plan ahead and see um, how many outfits you need. Are you planning on going out in the evening? I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, then let me know if you would like me to upload more of these kinds of videos or any other type of content. If you've been to international competitions yourself or if you have any tips, then let me know in the comments down below. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. My suitcase seems to have a really large oil spot, so please ignore that. We're starting off with knee sleeves. My national team is sponsored by SPD, that's why I'm bringing SPD knee sleeves with me. Moving on to squat shoes. I have heeled shoes specifically for squats because it makes it a lot easier for me to hit depth. Some people use the same shoes uh, as they would for their deadlifts and bench press. Um, unfortunately for me, I have to bring two separate shoes. I'm also bringing my lifting belt and wrist straps, so really important for you not to forget those. I also always bring liquid chalk with me because it's always smart to bring your own chalk with you to any type of competition. I'm also bringing my deadlift slippers with me. Like I said before, I use different shoes for the other two lifts from my squats. Here I'm bringing some snacks with me for during the competition. I bring something with me called ontbijtkoek. It's something Dutch and it's just 100% carbs, which I love during my training. Also bringing some wafers and protein bars. Uh, this is depending on how hungry I am. I just want to have the option to eat a lot more if I need to. One important thing that I also bring with me is electrolytes. I'm going to do a slight water cut, so it's really important for me to rehydrate as quickly as possible, which is why electrolytes come in handy. I'm also bringing some much needed caffeine. I'll be bringing my favorite pre-workout, which is the alpha pre-workouts from my protein. As you can see, I'm adding two scoops and I'll be taking this somewhere during my bench warm-up. Um, before squats, I'll just be drinking an iced cappuccino. I also brought some cyclic dextrin with me. Um, I just forgot to film that part. Cyclic dextrin is a powdered form of carbs which gets absorbed really quickly by your body. Almost all the supplements that I use are from my protein. I'll detail it more in the caption down below. I'm also bringing my competition outfit with me. This is the national team t-shirt. I'm also packing my 
team singlets and I'm also bringing my team training suits. You need your team training suits for the medal ceremony so it's really important that you bring that with you as well. I'm also bringing an extra t-shirt just in case I need it and I'm also packing some regular socks and some deadlift socks. Another thing I'll need for my competition is a pre-workout meal or post weigh in meal which I will just buy at a local store. Another thing I'm bringing is baby powder and obviously my passport. Um, however, I'm packing the baby powder in my backpack as it's more convenient that way and I need my passport during the boarding process at the airport so I'm just bringing that in my backpack as well. This is everything I need for the competition so now we're moving on to all the other stuff that I'm bringing with me. Here's my toiletry bag with um, all the skincare, shower care, everything that I need. I'm also packing a lot of underwear. Um, I don't know if you're the same as me, but when I have a seven day trip, I pack for 14 days. <laughs> I just feel that I need a lot of extra underwear just in case anything happens. I'm also bringing a few pairs of pants and um, a few different pairs of PJs because I'm staying a little bit longer than normal. A lot of uh, tops because I don't know if we're going to do something at night, especially after I've had my competition. So I'm bringing some extra tops with me. I'm also bringing a lot of gym clothes. Um, the reason why I bring gym clothes with me is because I still have one training uh, before my competition left. And I'm also going to be helping a few of my other teammates when they have their competition. And this is really important for me to just be able to run around. Um, it's best to just wear gym clothes. I'm also bringing a few pair of of gym socks the same story as the underwear story i just feel like you never have enough socks and never have enough underwear so i just pack a lot of extra just in case i'm also bringing sweaters with me as it can get quite cold at night uh, i do have a jacket but i just thought about bringing two pairs of sweaters just in case I need it inside. I'm also bringing my supplements with me. I usually take magnesium, creatine, a multivitamin, and zinc. Some other items that I'm bringing with me in my backpacks are uh, my makeup bag, my straightener, an extra pair of shoes, and some snacks for on the plane. So that basically sums it up. This is everything that I bring with me to an international competition. Um, if you have any items that you could always bring with you that you didn't see in this video, then let me know in the comments down below. Uh, let me know if you enjoyed this video as well. And I hope to see you at the next one.